Hello everybody, this is Joseph Deshays here, and welcome back to the Joseph Deshays YouTube channel. Woo. In this episode, UFO Update Part 2. So, forgive me if it's hard to hear me mumbling. I'm mumbling. I got some allergies, whatnot, congestion. Uh, back to what I was talking about. <laughs> oh, excuse me. Um. If you are ready. If you are ready, <laughs> I don't know why I said it like that. If you are ready, <laughs> you are ready to contact some ETs, hit me up in the emails. I can, I can put you in contact with other people in my group that are have been therapists not gonna name names but I have I know some people I got some people that were therapists that have knowledge of the UFO topics so folks I'm just saying don't be afraid to hit me up and I got an open mind and I'm ready to give you energy if you want a free cons if a free uh energy work i can do energy work for free free consultations joe66d at gmail.com that's all i'm saying i'm gonna i'm gonna send you over to the ce5 stephen greer's CE5 protocols if you're ready to contact make contact uh, you have to download the CE5 app it's $10 but if you don't have it again you can just hit me up in the emails I can, I can send you over information about the protocols to make contact with the extraterrestrials on your own on your own pace um but it starts getting crazy like once you start experiencing stuff that you can't explain I'm just trying to I'm just trying to keep it real it's like a lot of unexplainable stuff be going on in this world from my own experiences that has made me want to freak out and like in in bad ways and in good ways simultaneously like cause you can get like all upset about like not having knowledge pertaining to what's going on in these experiences but sometimes you can also get <clears throat> overly excited sometimes i can get overly excited also like like oh my gosh it's so amazing oh my gosh i'm like freaking out i'm like holy shit that's so freaking amazing I'm like ah oh, freaking ets can't wait to freaking meet them so there's understanding Understanding these emotions, feelings, is what it all comes back to. So, so this is why my channel, again, this channel is about energy and spirit discussion. Because this is who I am is I'm on this awakening 
journey, this journey of awakening, self-discovery, that for me and for you and many others, we know for a fact that there's more to life than all this. There's more, there is more to each one of us. There's so much more to each one of us. Power, in terms of power, intelligence, than we will ever be able to comprehend in this physical brain, in this physical body. So, uh, thank you for watching. I just want to let y'all know that, like, it's not, it's not what it seems. I'm here to talk. I'm here to keep it real. I'm going to be here. I'm real and you're real and we are all real. And I understand it's going to be upsetting. It's going to, you're going to get angry. You're going to get excited. It's going to be all types of things that, all types of things that make it so that it's difficult for us to relax. But the thing is, once you're able to relax and we can just take it easy and breathe. Just take this moment with me, folks. Guys, I'm just trying to keep it real. Excuse me. I'm trying to explain what's going on with me and my journey and that I keep taking on. <clears throat> it keeps being a lot of things going on. Like I keep taking on things and I'm always on these processes. I'm always taking time. And I'm always noticing more and more proof of the importance of just letting it, letting things go and just being, just, there's nothing, not, not like you got to do anything, like you you don't got to do anything. Like, there's nothing you have to do. Like, you just be yourself. Like, as long as... As long as you got the... Like, what you got to do done. You got done what you got to do. And then... Like, just don't... Just don't let it let it get to you like you start thinking like oh like it's not a big deal anyway like what does it matter like me just taking time to relax like no that's dangerous like we have to take time for each we gotta take our time to relax <sighs> let things go and just Understand that understanding, like, it's easy, it's so easy for a lot of different things to make us get riled up, get, get all aggressive, but there's no reason, like, if I really sit and think about it, you really just sit and think about it feel in your heart it's like I ain't buying it I ain't buying it just 
I ain't buying it. We ain't, there's nothing you got to buy into. I, I ain't telling, I ain't giving any type of, type of philosophy for you to buy into. I'm just, I'm just going to give you some crazy experiences and I'm, I'm going to be open to hear y'all's crazy experiences to help each other like we have to have further discussions to further our own knowledge so it's just like what's going on is a lot going on and there's a lot a lot of deeper levels to everything that's going on <laughs> Um, but the most, the most coolest thing is you. you. I just, I just have hope in me that, that y'all are, y'all are going to continue your awakening journey. Y'all are going to become aware that you are yo you guys are on your path you guys are already on your paths Uh, sorry for the pause. I was thinking what to say. I think I think I want to say that y'all y'all are gonna find out and and you all y'all already are finding out right now about your abilities. The abilities that are innate, innate inside of you. Inside of you, you have everything you need.
it's just stuff gets r real 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 quick like once you have experiences like you already know it's like you already know you guys already know like when you're out of body you can you have no idea like how much you can do like what you're capable of like So for right now, so the most important thing is relaxing, taking it easy, and we're going to further our discussions about energy and spirit. <clears throat> And how these energy fields are who we are. Who we are is energy. Sentient energy. S spirit is sentient energy. And we are auric fields. The more we are morphogenetic, the morphic fields are the auric, auric fields are the byproduct frequency byproduct of our frequency byproduct of our frequencies or something. So, you exist in multiple, you exist in multiple dimensions, is, is what you're awakening to. So just keep, just keeping it real right now. The reality of awakening right now, spiritually is is that you find out f for yourself you know for yourself for me i'm just saying i know for myself that i exist on the other side simultaneously as i exist here I'm not pushing that onto anyone. I'm just having further discussions if that is the case for you. Because, look, here's the question. It's like, if you're questioning the other side, it's like, if if you're thinking that your spirit goes to heaven after you die if you feel like you're you go to heaven after you die which is that's a that's a normal thing to think that's awesome it's just but if you think critically about it it's like how does your spirit go there if there's not already a road to go on so the understanding is you find out there's a path there is a tether the, the a ether the a ether field is your tether tether aether 
you are tethered to the other side. I can't. There's no way for me to make you believe that. Uh, but it's just like you have to have your own experiences. And... But even even if you do have your own experiences, it's I still understand that it's still like a crazy it's still like very difficult it's not easy for people to grasp these other dimensions in spiritual realms type of thing if they're not having experiences of their own so I understand that and I also understand that for me I'm gonna keep having more and more experiences I'm not gonna I, le I already learned way back like I'm not gonna stop having nightmares like it's like I might never get to deeper reasons as to certain certain nightmares that were so crazy like or like there's a lot of deeper questions with this reality that is like it's just, this is a natural, this is just me trying to keep it real right now. I just, if I'm not talking about stuff now, I'm just going to talk about it later. It's just like, it's, I ain't bullshitting around. It's just, it is what it is. And it's like. It's like, you wanna, it's like, if you think that you wanna go look on the other side, it's like, you're already there. If you wanna, if you wanna look on the other side, you're already there. It's that easy. All you have to do is breathe. You match the frequencies of the tether, the source field. That's all it is. You just match the frequencies and then, bam, you're already there. So it's like, y'all are going to experience so much. Just don't worry about spirit guides lying to you. They're going to lie to you. That's just what they do. Just, just the animals, just, you, there's no question you don't don't ever question what the animals are telling you the animals never lie so look i'm not gonna say like i'm not gonna say like oh like i know all types of stuff i know like more than animals than other people or something like no i'm not saying that like anything like that i'm saying like I'm trying to humble myself, like, I just, I might not even know what I'm talking about, guys, like, don't even buy into what I'm saying that much, but look, in my opinion, if you want to know more about compassion and how to be honorable, just look at the animals, just look at the animals around you, and look, I'm not all this knowledgeable guy, like, there's only so much you're gonna get from me, but look, in my opinion, if you want ancient, deeper knowledge, just look at the trees around you. Talk to the trees. In my opinion, there's no... No one has, like, deeper, ancient knowledge than these trees. So try to reach out to your spirit guides. Reach out to the trees. Reach out to the animals. Thank you. Thank you, spirit guides, for being here. Don't worry about them lying. They're going to lie to you. Leprechauns are going to trick you. Pretty soon we're going to meet the fairies. And it's going to be a lot going on. It's it's going to get wild, folks. But. We're going to have further discussions. But 
it's gonna get crazy like the fairies once the fairies come here they're gonna like solidify so much information about who we are how the fairies used to be up here with us how their dimension got created the reasons with the how the half and half animal human hybrids was getting out of whack on this planet so the lower dimensions were created for, for the half and half beings half animal half humans to go down there and and also the fairies so so the fairies used to be up here with us so they went down into energy bodies so the fairies are very much knowledgeable about crossing over dimensions and how they do it they're gonna explain it to us and they're gonna help us alongside they're gonna be alongside us basically like they already are pretty like they already are it's it's so crazy like trying to talk about this stuff it's like it's like you all you guys already know or you don't know it's like you already know everything i'm talking about almost not everything but like it almost seems like it or or you're either like it totally in the dark about what i'm talking about like but that's where we're at it's like it's no big deal like Look, if you're watching this right now and you feel lost about you don't know where to go, you don't know where to turn in life, you, you can't decide like but you know that you, but you know inside that you want to do something good, you want to help. It's like that's your uh, that's your confirmation that you're awakening. That right there is the confirmation that you're awakening because I think because it's like you don't inside of you you don't want to we don't want to be told what to do and it's like we've been told what to do we've been told who we are we've been lied to our whole existence and it's like the truth is inside of us everything we need is already inside of us so So it's like you just it's like you just gotta follow your heart and it's like 
for me, from my perspective, I just got to follow my heart. And, but it's like, it's my heart and your heart, your heart is your heart. It's like your own, your mind is your mind. It's like, this is just is what it is. It's like, there's going to be all these moments where we're doing telepathy. Like we're thinking the same thing. Oh my gosh. And like, we're feel having the same feelings and we're having mutual connections but there's also there's even more times that it seems uncertain and like mysterious but I'm just I just want to let you all know that it's gonna be all right and we're gonna keep it pushing and I'm gonna be doing what I gotta do but you're gonna see me pop up on here from time to time and I appreciate everyone of you for watching and it's like I guess that's all I want to say for me it's like I don't really I get uh, the way I am right now I guess it's the way I am right now it's like I don't really know what to talk about, but at the same time, I have uh, urges, I have the urge inside of me, like, I have to talk about these things, and that, I don't know who needs to hear this, it's like, somebody needs to hear this, it's like, I don't know who's gotta reach out to me, but like, some, somebody's gotta reach out to me or something, I don't know. Just question, just question everything, folks. Don't be afraid to question everything. There ain't nothing to be afraid of. Ain't no reason we can't all work together. So. It's like, we already know it's gonna get crazier and crazier. So. I just want to let y'all know that it's going to get more and more important. More important and more important to chillax, relax, keep it easy. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to keep it easy. And that is about it. The UFO update. I'm not going out of my way to go look for UFOs. I'm not going out trying to look in the sky for UFOs. It's like, it just happens to me. Like, it just happened. We, we were just driving to five below. It was just in the sky. Like, I just randomly, I just randomly snap pics of the sky. We're in Cape Cod. It's like, oh shit, there's this flying saucer in the picture. It's like, I'm not trying to find it. It's just there. So, I'm just keeping it real. It seems so crazy, right? Like, all this stuff I'm talking about. It's like, there's no way for me. There's no way for me to... I'm in this position where it's like, it's a conundrum. It's like, there's no way for any, to expect anyone to hear what I'm saying, listen to me and fully understand and grasp everything I'm talking about and all the experiences I've had that I'm trying to communicate. It's like, so I just love y'all so much. It's like for just being here, hearing me out. Of those of you that have been listening to me, listened to all of me, all of my videos, thank you so much. It's just gonna seem like a fantasy. It's gonna, we're gonna keep getting caught in the traps of the illusions and the stuff trying to take us off our paths, it seems like. 
but just don't worry just know like just as easy as it is to get off our path this is just as easy to get back on our path so just keeping it easy keeping it real joseph to is here more videos more videos are coming soon just be aware of that stay tuned peace out meow